Welcome to the 19th episode of Let's Learn Redstone. This time, we're going to talk about the target block. The target block will emit a redstone signal when it's hit by a snowball or an arrow. You can also use a dispenser shooting projectiles to activate the target block. You can pull a signal out from underneath it or directly from the target block itself. The signal strength emitted depends on where on the face that it's hit. If it's hit in the bullseye, it will emit a maximum strength of 15. For archery games, you can use a repeater or a comparator to adjust the success rate of the shot. So a repeater close by will make it even where bad shots are a success, whereas comparators will ignore bad shots and force you to get good shots, depending on how many items there are in the container. And the last feature of the target block we're going to discuss is its ability to redirect redstone. So sometimes you just can't get the redstone to go where you want it to, but redstone will connect two target blocks and they are a solid block in regards to redstone signals. So you can redirect the redstone using target blocks for some tight spaces that would otherwise be impossible.